You can solve linear inequalities using similar methods to those for solving linear equations. First, let's take a look at this example. Find the set of values of x for which 2x minus 3 is less than 5. So, 2x less than 5 plus 3 gives us 2x less than 8 dividing by 2 results in x less than 4. 6x minus 3 greater than 2x plus 7. So, 6x minus 2x greater than 7 plus 3. 4x greater than 10. Now, divide both sides by 4. So, x greater than 5 over 2. 2 times x minus 3 greater than or equal to 0. First, expand the brackets. 2x minus 6 greater than or equal to 0. Add 6 to both sides. So, 2x greater than or equal to 6. x greater than or equal to 3. x minus 2 times 5 plus 2x less than 11. Expanding the brackets gives us x minus 10 minus 4x less than 11. Collect the like terms. So, minus 3x minus 10 less than 11. Adding 10 to both sides gives us minus 3x less than 21. Now, you can divide both sides by minus 3 and therefore you need to turn around the inequality sign. Whenever you divide an inequality by a negative number, you have to reverse the inequality sign. So, x greater than minus 7. There are times when you might need to find the set of values for which two inequalities are true together. In cases like this, number lines can be very useful in finding the solutions. For example, find the set of values of x for which 2x minus 5 less than x minus 1 and 7 times x plus 1 greater than 23 minus x. First, let's take the inequality 2x minus 5 less than x minus 1. So, 2x minus x less than 5 minus 1 x less than 4. And for 7 times x plus 1 greater than 23 minus x, expand the brackets first. So, 7x plus 7 greater than 23 minus x, 7x plus x greater than 23 minus 7. 8x greater than 16x greater than 2. Now, let's draw a number line to illustrate the two inequalities. The number line here represents the values for x less than 4. This shows the set of all values of x for which x is less than 4. Remember, if a hollow dot is used in a number line, that means the end value is not included. Hollow dot is used for less than and greater than inequalities. A colored in dot is used for less than or equal to and greater than or equal to inequalities. If a fully colored dot is used, that means the end value is included. The number line given here illustrates both x less than 4 and x greater than 2 inequalities. As you can see here, both the inequalities overlap between 2 and 4. The values in the overlapping area are the only real values that satisfy both inequalities simultaneously. So, the solution is x greater than 2 less than 4. 3 times x minus 2 greater than x minus 4 and 4x plus 12 greater than 2x plus 17. So, for 3 times x minus 2 greater than x minus 4, 3x minus 6 greater than x minus 4, 3x minus x greater than 6 minus 4, 2x greater than 2x greater than 1. And 4x plus 12 greater than 2x plus 17, 4x minus 2x greater than 17 minus 12, x greater than 5 over 2. The number line here represents the inequality x greater than 1 and here you can see both the inequalities x greater than 1 and x greater than 5 over 2. As you can see, the two sets of values start to intersect from where x greater than 5 over 2 and hence the solution is x greater than 5 over 2. 15 minus x less than 2 times 11 minus x and 5 times 3x minus 1 greater than 12x plus 19. So, 15 minus x less than 2 times 11 minus x, 15 minus x less than 22 minus 2x, x less than 7. 5 times 3x minus 1 greater than 12x plus 19, 15x minus 5 greater than 12x plus 19, 3x greater than 24x greater than 8. x less than 7, x greater than 8. As you can see, none of these inequalities overlap. There is no overlap between the two sets of values and hence there are no values. Since and is used here, this means it has to satisfy both inequalities for x to qualify. And hence, there are no values here. 3x plus 8 less than or equal to 20 and 2 times 3x minus 7 greater than or equal to x plus 6. So, first let's find the values separately. 3x plus 8 less than or equal to 20, 3x less than or equal to 12, x less than or equal to 4. 2 times 3x minus 7 greater than or equal to x plus 6, 6x minus 14 greater than or equal to x plus 6, 5x greater than or equal to 20, x greater than or equal to 4. 
The two sets of values overlap only when x equals 4 as x is greater than or equal to 4 and x is less than or equal to 4. And hence the solution is x equals 4. x minus 5 greater than 1 minus x or 15 minus 3x greater than 5 plus 2x. So, x minus 5 greater than 1 minus x, 2x greater than 6x greater than 3. 15 minus 3x greater than 5 plus 2x, 10 greater than 5x, x less than 2. The number line here represents both the inequalities x greater than 3 or x less than 2. As you can see here, there is no overlap between the two sets of values. But remember, here we said x minus 5 greater than 1 minus x or 15 minus 3x greater than 5 plus 2x. When O is used, this means it can satisfy either one of the inequalities or both. And hence, the solution is x greater than 3 or x less than 2.